Hey guys, if you're looking to build a volcano for your school project like Sky has just done, we will show you how to build one like this with real looking glittery lava and grass all around with some trees and a little fence. We'll be able to show you how to do that in the video straight after this introduction. Show everybody what you're going to need to use to make the volcano, and I'll run through the prices. Need this. Right, so we've used um, what it is as a dog collar. It's very handy. You can get them in any sort of pet store. This was like one pound fifty, but it's really good to use as the base of your volcano. And what we're going to put it onto, Sky? This. So we're going to put it onto the canvas, which is what we're going to mount it onto. And the canvas was one pound fifty. At our local bargain store. We, you can get them from pound stores and stuff like that. It's just literally just a base so that it's easy to carry for her to take to school. What else have we got, Sky? We need the glue. The glue. So we've got PVA glue. Um, uh, the PVA glue, do you know how much that was? Because I didn't go with you to buy the glue. Did you get it at the pound store? Um, I don't know how much it says. Do you know how much it was roughly? I think you probably got it from Poundland, did you? Okay, if it's from Poundland, then it's going to be a pound. And we don't know how much. That's fine. So, it's no, a pound, because it's Poundland. No, two pound, because one pound is two Okay, pound. for two, yeah, for two is two pound. Excellent. This one. That is just some A4 cards that, um, what are they, coloured sheets. What are we going to use them for? We're going to use this for the trees. Mm-hmm. And also, we are we're going to use it for the floor as well, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, for the yeah. floor. This one is for the uh, branch trees as well. The trees, yep. Yeah. The, the leaves. We might... Where's the... We might use this. We're going to use that. For we're going to use the stalks. The... For the we trees. might use them for the stalks, yeah. But we're going to use the black to um, PVA glue onto the actual base of the volcano, the aren't we? Here. To make it black. How are we going to put... How are we going to apply the PVA glue? What are we going to use? Look to your left. Are you right, sorry? Right, we're right. This By your knee. Paintbrushes! They were actually 99p at the home bargain store that was in town, so they're pretty cheap. So everything is pretty cheap so far. What haven't we shown everybody? Oh, the, the thing beforehand, Sky, the one that we're going to wrap the tissue papers, we didn't run through that. That was 60p for them tissues, wasn't it? Yes. So that's pretty cheap. Also, um, what about the glitter paint for the glitter lava? Paint. This so, is this lava. is green glitter paint. It'll go paint. all the way around the top, then it'll go down the side. So, it'll make it look like lava, won't it? And it'll be glittery. Very glittery. Yeah. We need scissors, which we've got scissors. there. Which we need, we need to adult this. supervision, which is why I'm here. Yeah, we'll do that in a moment. And then also, we need tape, because we need to tape some things down. We need to tape to the base before we paper mache it. And then, then these are for the lava bits that go inside, inside. the volcano. To make it look like there's going to be lava. We'll, pro we'll probably only use this one and this one. Yeah, we probably will. We might use some of the green for the trees, maybe. Yeah. So then right, so turn the canvas upside down, which is that white piece on the floor where the volcano is. Turn that up the other way. This one, Sky. What? Down there. Turn that um, canvas upside down. And inside there are some little sticks, which we're going to use as the tree trunks. Okay? Which is going to be very handy. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go to the first step that we're going to need first to do. First step is to cut open this. Right, first step is to cut open that. You start doing that and then I'm going to switch off for a minute until we get to the next step. Uh, next we're going to cut uh, these. So cut the little tabs off. Because you don't want those tabs because they're just going to be in the way. This guy's already unwrapped the um, canvas base, ready to go. What we're going to do after we've done this guy, be careful with those scissors, please. Next, we'll probably have to glue this on there. Obviously. Okay, cut the last tab off. Don't hold the end of the scissors, just cut it normally. That's it. Just put the scissors down further. That's it. Better. There, Excellent. so that was the finished 
Okay, step. on to the next step. We've already done one piece of grass, we have to do the next one. So we need, where is it? It's over here. It's grass. We need this glue first. PVA glue, yep. And we need to just squeeze it all the way around. Then we might just have to do... Yeah, a little bit in the middle. It doesn't have to be neat because it's going to be covered up most of it. So now we have to um, stick it down, make sure there's no glue. Oh, let me see. And then you just stick it down, push it down very gently. Stick this down onto here. So we what are you going to stick it down with? The tape? The tape we've the already pre cut. We've already pre cut the tape. It's over here. We only need a little bit. bit of that there. Make sure it's okay. You want it to centre, don't you? Stick down. Stick. There we go. Brilliant. Next. On the side. Brilliant. Pick that up and stick it. Then we will mop to do it down here. Yep, both right the side. Just keep thinking I have to do more, but it's okay. It's already pre cut tape, haven't we? We've already cut the tape to the sizes we need. Keeps getting stick to my blanket. Done there. So we just need to paste on the PVA glue, we put it into a bowl, so we just need to use the paintbrush and paste it round, which we've already done. Do you want to show them a bit where you put the um, glue on with the paintbrush? Well, we just have to go, go on top and underneath. Stick it down with the brush. And it doesn't matter if you get the glue on top of the black because it's just um, going to dry clear anyway and it will just harden that up. Show them that corner how you're going to do that. That's it, bit of glue underneath. That's it. And then just paint over the top of it. That's lovely, it doesn't have to be perfect because Volcanoes are mountainy, aren't they? So they're going to be yep. rigid anyway. So then we'll show you uh, the rest when it's all black. Yeah, so we'll carry on, we'll do the rest of it, and then we'll show them what it looks like when we finish it. Yeah? So we need to have this brown. We put it round the top, round there. So we need to make sure it's straight. So we've gone round with all the black, and now she's just going to put a brown top. Once you've done the brown sky around the top, when PVA'd it on, what are you going to use after that? You're going to use a nice orange, so it looks like the lava. Yes. Yeah. I'll Just show do that. How to do it. So this is how what she's been doing to put them on. If you can't, there's a bit of space at the top. You might want to put it a bit in the volcano. So should we um, come back to this? We did a brown. And then we did like a, an orange, didn't we, for the top to make it look a bit more lavery. Once this is all dry, it'll look pretty good. She's going to go around the bottom now with we some grass at the bottom. Off. We scrunch it show them into under, Come down here and show them because they can't see it. That way We've already done one. Yeah, you need to scrunch it here. So put another piece off and do it again because they couldn't see because it wasn't in camera. So just grab a bit. It's very messy. Down here, scrunch it. Scrunch it all up. Scroll it ball. into a ball. We'll need the little one. The PVLA glue, yeah. We'll just Be quite generous with it, Sky. Get it, get it work quite a bit. Put a little bit, put that back in there. And then we stick it. There you go. Well, that's good. So that's going to be like our marsh um, ground there, isn't it, on the bottom? We're going to go around and do all that and then come back? We did all it around 
bit of yellow there because we didn't have enough green. And now we are doing some trees. trees. So we need these pieces of wood. This is one of the trees we've made. We'll show you how to make the tree. Uh, it's just using the bits of wood that came with the actual, um, what was the canvas, that was it. Yeah. Just show them how to make one. So we just cut out a bit of green out of that cardboard there, didn't this guy? Just basically made it look like a cloud and made it smaller at the bottom. So what are you doing now? Yeah, so you're going to... To do that. Just put some PVA glue on there. Yeah. You need quite a lot at the top more than all the rest. Yeah. Then we'll get this. It'll have glue on for the rest of them. Can you do it on the floor so that we can see? Yeah. Yeah. Do that right under there. That's it. Just wipe your hand on the base if you want. The base? Yeah, because it's going to go clear anyway. Okay, then what's the next bit to do? Next bit is to get another piece of wood. Bubble glue down here. Bit of a big thick bit. Get some more glue. That's it. Put a big bit on. That's it. And then plant the tree on it. Plonk the tree here. There. Perfect. So those are two trees. Yeah, so just need to wait for that to dry now. We're going to put a few more trees on, aren't we? We're going to do four trees in total. Aren't we? About one here, one here. Get this. Put it down so they can we see. We scrunch it. it up and we put it in there. We actually need one. What did we do before though? We've gone round and done we, trees. We stuck the trees done down. We've done some trees. We've put some of this so then it and stays. And you've, you've stripped, you've ripped some paper into like shreds and then you've just put it down so yeah. it's more like... Um, Staged grass wasn't easy. And then we'll use this. We can't see it, Sky. We'll use this. We'll. <laughs> just... no. okay. We'll use this. Yeah. We'll Inside. scrunch it up. Yeah. Put it in there. The same as this. So let's get it started. Use this. What is it? Glitter, glitter paint. Glitter paint, and it's orange like what? Like lava. It will go. Round here, oh, and we did do this. Yeah. Yellow, brown, red on top for the lava. This will be dripping down all the way down. Okay, show them some then. We won't knock on the trees over. Okay. We'll start. Just like come around here. Yeah, kind of so. Yeah. So. Go right at the top. Okay. Yep. That's enough on there. On there. It, it will drip down like lava. Would do. Okay. Should we go around and um, let me just show them a little bit where we can do it. So what we want to do is just fill it up here and then let it run all the way down. And then this will go dry at some point. And this is the lava's like it can go anywhere because you never know where lava will end up. And then that will run down. So then and dry should we? Out. We'll, we'll put it like in the air and cupboard or something and dry it out. So we'll go around and do it and then we'll show them what it looks like when it's finished, yeah? Yeah. I was just finishing off the volcano. How's it getting on, Sky? Looking good? Cool. So there you go, guys. That's how you make a volcano. It actually didn't take that long.